Hello, what's going on guys? Welcome to a new video where in front of me, we've got a lot of stuff to unbox today. So we should just get started. So before the holidays, I got sent a lot of packages that I just didn't have a chance to open, but we're back and it's still tech season. I'm just gonna assume that tech season is year long now. And I have a lot of really cool stuff in front of me that I wanted to show you guys. So I figured I would just do this all in one big tech haul video. So let's open some stuff up, okay? So this is actually one of the cooler things that I've received in quite some time. These are custom Star Wars Mandalorian Xbox controllers. Let's open it up. Oh my gosh. And these are the new Xbox controllers too, which have the share button. The back, the Mandalorian, whoa. The one thing I love about Xbox is that they always give you the batteries. They never leave you hanging. The child, this orange color is incredible with the Mandalorian on the back. I love it. I didn't even realize until I looked into the monitor that it says this is the way. So this is pretty cool. I'm probably gonna keep this box forever. Very cool, thank you Xbox. Oh, I have hurt my wrist. Okay, I'm very weak. While we're on the topic of Mandalorian, we have something from Google, which Google presents Star Wars The Mandalorian AR Experience. So this was a gift from Google and I have a feeling I know what's inside because I saw a lot of other of my friends talk about it and I was very jealous. Take your fandom to the next level with a little help from Google Pixel. Check out the Mandalorian AR Experience app on the new Pixel 5. So we have the Pixel 5. We have the Pixel Buds as well as oh, a nice case. I'm so thankful that companies are now doing easy pull tabs on boxes. Is that lipstick or is that blood? Am I bleeding? The air has been so dry that my skin is so dry. My knuckles have just been like bleeding randomly. So that's cool. Oh, what a nice size. Incredible color, love it. I've actually have never owned a Google Pixel phone before, but I've always heard and seen really great things. So this was sent to me over a month ago, so I have a feeling it's dead. But that's okay, because guess what? It comes with a cable. Oh, look at this. It also comes with a very nice brick. Huh, that's rare. All right, now the Google Pixel Buds. Oh, wow, these are really nice. Let's see if they stay in my ear because I've been having a lot of trouble with things staying in my ears and I still get like harassed every day for making an AirPods video where they're like, you didn't put them in your ear right. And I'm like, okay, well it's been over a year and they still don't stay in my ear no matter how I try, so. Oh, this is, the Google Pixels actually stay in my ear? Oh my gosh, what? I think the Pixel Buds, I think they were made for my tiny, tiny little ear. This is so exciting. And, oh, whoa, this is cool. This is real funky. Interesting, okay, cool. Next up, this has been something that I've been excited to try out. These are the Echo Frames. So these are actually from Amazon. They're a, basically a pair of frames where you can use your um, voice enabled services and they actually have like speakers on them. I haven't tried them obviously because I haven't opened them up yet, but this is gonna be cool. Oh, it's got the nice little Amazon box. These are really lightweight. Oh, oh my gosh, how do I look? I can't see myself in the camera. Is that too close to my face? These also come with a really nice little case. Oh, a cleaning cloth as well. Fully charge your Echo Frames, download the Amazon Alexa app. I already have that because I basically use it every day. Okay, cool. Oh, oh, there's a red light. Let's get started. Follow the instructions in the Alexa app. Okay, oh my gosh, they're on. Echo frames found nearby. There they are, echo frames. Increase the volume, press the front button to decrease the volume. Hold your echo frames at arm's length and lower the volume until the audio is not noticeable. This is so cool, so it has speakers that basically only you can hear. Let's look at how to manage notifications on your echo frames. The VIP filter allows you to customize your experience. You can select which contacts or apps you'll hear from. All right, let me see if I can do a visible demonstration for you. I showed this before with my Sony headphones. Alexa, turn off all lights. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. She's in my head. Listen, listen. Alexa, turn on all lights. Oh my gosh, and she turned on my nano leaf lights. I can't believe this. So also like if I make a phone call on here, I can just talk normally because this is 
connected, I guess, through Bluetooth so that I can just actually take a phone call on here without having to have anything in my ears. This could actually be the solution for me having trouble wearing AirPods and headphones. Order toilet paper. There are lots of options for toilet paper. I can help you find what you are looking for. If you want Cottonelle, say buy Cottonelle toilet paper. Or for Angel Soft, say buy Angel Soft toilet paper. Can we all just take a minute to appreciate the fact that I can order toilet paper from my glasses? That might be the coolest thing I've ever experienced. All right, on to the next thing. This is something that I've had for a couple months and I've been trying to do an unboxing and I've been excited about it and I just haven't had a chance to do it. But this is actually the new Microsoft Surface Pro X. Now I've had the original and I use the original all the time, but this is the new one. As you guys know, like I'm obsessed with Surface. I'm obsessed with Microsoft. I love them. I use the Surface Pro X all the time. This is the Platinum with 256 gigs as well as 16 gigs of memory. Like I'm very excited for this. Let's open it up. Oh, the platinum is nice. The platinum is real nice. It's like that traditional Microsoft look. Let me use the little stand, put you there. We also have the SIM card ejector, which this is great because you can be connected on the go if you do have an active SIM card. I'm Cortana. Hello, Cortana. Yeah, Yes, you are. This actually feels so much faster than the other Surface Pro X, and I'm only Mission in the settings. Use your face to sign in. Yeah, you know we love a good face sign in. Almost done, just need to get a few more things. Okay, well while you're doing that. <gasps> oh yeah. So then it just easily attaches like this, and we're good to go. And then this is my favorite part, ready to go. This feels so nice. The camera looks nice. Whoa, the camera looks incredible. Okay, I've used a lot of laptops and I've been using a lot of laptops and even the MacBook built-in camera just sometimes looks like trash. This looks so good. Okay. Hey guys, what's going on? So we're just testing out the video here on the new Surface Pro X. Hey guys, what's going on? So we're just testing out the video here on the new Surface Pro X. This is my slim pen. Wait, this sounds really good and it looks really good. I'm very impressed so far and I've only used it for like 0.5 seconds. Also has like the back camera too. What? You guys can't see this. I don't even know how to show you. I'm freaking out right now. Can you see me? Is it a good example? Probably not. I am doing all of my meetings on here from now on, my Zoom, my Teams, it's happening on this. Stay tuned for a full review once I use it a little bit more because I'm just, shocked how nice this is and it's so small compact portable i don't really know how to feel right now okay last but not least is something that is going to be a game changer for me personally and professionally oh, oh my gosh oh my gosh it's really heavy because it's very very nice this is the owc thunder bay 4. Professional grade four bay Thunderbolt 3 storage solution. Now, as you guys may or may not know, I recently lost everything on my MacBook and I have no idea why, but for some reason everything was on it. I just, I didn't have many external drives and it just kind of crashed and I lost a lot of things. So this is the Thunder Bay 4 and this is gonna be a game changer because I'm going to go through all of my old hard drives, I'm gonna go through my old laptops and I'm gonna finally back up everything because I never realized how, like how important backing up your storage was. You think I would have because I've lost stuff before, but it was really, really, really sad. And I was actually going through my past 10 years of like photos and videos. And I just realized I did not have a very good solution for storage. And when I look back, you know, 10 years from now, like I just want to have everything. I can't see what's happening up here. I gotta stand up. Oh, I have hit my head. The Thunder Bay 4. It's kind of hard to believe that this has 64 terabytes. So this is definitely gonna be my solution for my home office because this isn't something that you travel with. So this is basically the start guide. Uh, it's the software aid technology, which is a family of Mac and PC applications designed to configure your OWC storage solution with one or more RAID volumes. Honestly, it's gonna be so nice having all of my very important files stored safely here. So I'm really excited to set this up and get all the information off of like all of my old MacBooks. I wanna start um, like donating or getting rid of some stuff. I haven't done it because 
because I was like, I don't have enough storage to put all of these files, and now I do. They've also sent me two other things to help with my other storage needs. This is definitely the at home staying here on my desk. Not only did they send me the Thunder Bay, but they also sent me the Thunder Blade. I mean, like, hi, you're in this very, very incredible case. So this is actually the eight terabyte Thunderblade. I took this home for the holidays because I had a lot of Final Cut project files. I had a lot of video files and I just needed more storage. So while this is a little bit bigger, it's actually not as heavy, but you wanna obviously be very careful with it. You do have to plug it into a power supply as well as obviously plugging it into your computer itself. This is great because Justine and I have been using this to do a lot of like podcast files. Like we have, we just have so many many files and I just feel like I need different storage options for different things. But I also have another storage solution that they sent that I've been using as like a more everyday type of thing. This is the OWC Envoy Pro EX. This is definitely a little bit smaller. This is actually four terabytes and this comes off as well. So this is more of my like immediate, as soon as I shoot this video, I take these files, I put them onto here. I've been using the M1 MacBook Pro, which is only 256 storage. So I definitely probably don't even have enough on that computer for these these two video files. But what I've been doing is I've been using this for like my current editing project. I will put my final cut file on here so that I have the whole editing project. I have the files. I have everything on here in case anything happens once again to my MacBook because it has happened. So there's definitely a lot of different storage options and shout out to OWC because they have been incredible and they have sent me these amazing things. I would take you through the process of me backing everything up, but that's going to be long and boring. But I will put links in the description if you guys want to check out any of these products. Let me know if you want any more videos on any of these things that I have mentioned. I definitely want to do a follow up on a few of these things because it's just so cool. Thank you so much to OWC for sending these as well as well as Amazon and Xbox and Microsoft and Google. I'm overwhelmed by the tech, but I'm very, very grateful and thankful. And I hope you guys are having a great start to the new year. Make sure you subscribe and I will see you again soon for a new video.